Hawaii Volcanoes National Park, established on August 1, 1916, is an American national park located in the U.S. state of Hawaii on the island of Hawaii. The park encompasses two active volcanoes, Kilauea, one of the world's most active volcanoes, and Mauna Loa, the world's most massive shield volcano. The park provides scientists with insight into the birth and development of the Hawaiian Islands, and ongoing studies into the processes of volcanism. For visitors, the park offers dramatic volcanic landscapes, as well as glimpses of rare flora and fauna. In recognition of its outstanding natural values, Hawaii Volcanoes National Park was designated as an International Biosphere Reserve in 1980 and a World Heritage Site in 1987. In 2012, Hawaii Volcanoes National Park was depicted on the 14th quarter of the America The Beautiful Quarters series. On May 10, 2018 the park was closed to the public in the Kilauea Volcano Summit area, including the visitor center and park headquarters, due to explosions and toxic ash clouds from Halamaumau Crater, as well as earthquakes and road damage. However, portions of the park, including the visitor center, reopened to the public on September 22, 2018. Eruptive activity, ground collapses and explosions in the park ceased in early August. As of late September, the lull in eruptive activity at Kilauea volcano continues. At the summit, seismicity and deformation are negligible. Sulfur dioxide emission rates at both the summit and the lower east rift zone are drastically reduced, the combined rate is lower than at any time since late 2007. Earthquake and deformation data show no net accumulation, withdrawal, or significant movement of subsurface magma or pressurization as would be expected if the system was building toward a resumption of activity. Environment The park includes 323,431 acres, 505.36 square miles, 1,308.88 square kilometers of land. Over half of the park is designated the Hawaii Volcanoes Wilderness Area and provides unusual hiking and camping opportunities. The park encompasses diverse environments that range from sea level to the summit of the Earth's most massive active volcano, Mauna Loa at 13,677 feet 4 Climates range from lush tropical rainforests, to the arid and barren Kau Desert. Recently eruptive sites include the main caldera of Kilauea and a more active but remote vent called Pu'u. The main entrance to the park is from the Hawaii Belt Road. The chain of craters road, as the name implies, leads past several craters from historic eruptions to the coast. It used to continue to another entrance to the park near the town of Kalapana, but that portion is now covered by a lava flow. History Kilauea and its Halamaumau caldera were traditionally considered the sacred home of the volcano goddess Pele, and Hawaiians visited the crater to offer gifts to the goddess. In 1790, a party of warriors along with women and children who were in the area were caught in an unusually violent eruption. Many were killed and others left footprints in the lava that can still be seen today. The first Western visitors to the site, English missionary William Ellis and American Asa Thurston, went to Kilauea in 1823. Ellis wrote of his reaction to the first sight of the erupting volcano A spectacle, sublime and even appalling, presented itself before us. We stopped and trembled, astonishment and awe for some moments rendered us mute, and, like statues, we stood fixed to the spot, with our eyes riveted on the abyss below. The volcano became a tourist attraction in the 1840s, and local businessmen such as Benjamin Pittman and George Lycurgus ran a series of hotels at the rim. Volcano House is the only hotel or restaurant located within the borders of the National Park. Lauren A. Thurston, grandson of the American missionary Asa Thurston, was one of the driving forces behind the establishment of the park after investing in the hotel from 1891 to 1904. William R. Castle first proposed the idea in 1903. Thurston, who then owned the Honolulu Advertiser newspaper, printed editorials in favor of the park idea. In 1907, the Territory of Hawaii paid for 50 members of Congress and their wives to visit Haleakala and Kilauea. It included a dinner cooked over lava steam vents. In 1908 Thurston entertained Secretary of the Interior James Rudolph Garfield, and in 1909 another congressional delegation. 
Governor Walter F. Freer proposed a draft bill in 1911 to create Kilauea National Park for $50,000. Thurston and local landowner William Herbert Shipman proposed boundaries, but ran into some opposition from ranchers. Thurston printed endorsements from John Muir, Henry Cabot Lodge, and former President Theodore Roosevelt. After several attempts, the legislation introduced by Delegate Jonah Kuhio Kalanianoole finally passed to create the park. House Resolution 9525 was signed by Woodrow Wilson on August 1, 1916. It was the 11th national park in the United States, and the first in a territory. Within a few weeks, the National Park Service Organic Act would create the National Park Service to run the system. Originally called Hawaii National Park, it was split from the Haleakala National Park on September 22, 1961 75 stat. 577 to be formally known as Hawaii I Volcanoes National Park. An easily accessible lava tube was named for the Thurston family. An undeveloped stretch of the Thurston lava tube extends an additional 1,100 feet meters beyond the developed area and dead ends into the hillside, but it is closed to the general public. In 2004, an additional 115,788 acres (468.58 square kilometers) of Kahuku Ranch were added to the park, making it 56% larger. This was an area west of the town of Waiohinu and east of Ocean View, the largest land acquisition in Hawaii's history. The land was bought for $21.9 million from the Samuel Mills Damon Estate, with financing from the Nature Conservancy. <laughs> Heads National Park Superintendents Historic places Several of the National Register of Historic Places listings on the island of Hawaii are located within the park 1790 Footprints Inaho Ranch Inapo Trail Kilauea Crater Puna Kau Historic District Volcano House Whitney Seismograph Vault No. 29 Wilkes Campsite Topic Visitor Center and Museums The main visitor center located just within the park entrance at 19 degrees 25 minutes 46 seconds north 155 degrees 15 minutes 25.5 seconds west includes displays and information about the features of the park the nearby Volcano Art Center, located in the original 1877 Volcano House Hotel, is listed on the National Register of Historic Places and now houses historical displays and an art gallery. The Thomas A. Jagger Museum, located a few miles west on Crater Rim Drive, features more exhibits and a close view of the Kilauea's active vent Halamaumau. The museum is named after scientist Thomas Jagger, the first director of the Hawaiian Volcano Observatory, which adjoins the museum. The observatory itself is operated by the U.S. Geological Survey and is not open to the public. Bookstores are located in the main visitor center and the Jagger Museum. The Kilauea Military Camp provides accommodations for U.S. military personnel. As of 2008, the superintendent was Cindy Orlando. Volunteer groups also sponsor events in the park. Topic: Painting of Pele. About 1929, D. Howard Hitchcock made an oil painting of Pele, the Hawaiian goddess of fire, lightning, wind, and volcanoes. In 1966, the artist's son, Harvey, donated the painting to the Hawaii Volcanoes National Park, where it was displayed in the Visitor's Center from 1966 to 2005. The painting was criticized for portraying the Hawaiian goddess as a Caucasian. In 2003, the Volcano Art Center announced a competition for a more modern and culturally authentic rendering of the goddess. An anonymous judging panel of native Hawaiian elders selected a painting by Arthur Johnson of Puna, Hawaii from 140 entries. In Johnson's painting, the goddess has distinctly Polynesian features. She is holding a digging stick in her left hand and the egg that gave birth to her younger sister Hiyaka in her right hand. In 2005, the Hitchcock was replaced with Johnson's painting.
Topic: <laughs> Recent events. On March 19, 2008, there was a small explosion in Halamaumau Crater, the first explosive event since 1924 and the first eruption in the Kilauea caldera since September 1982. Debris from the explosion was scattered over an area of 74 acres square meters. A small amount of ash was also reported at a nearby community. The explosion covered part of Crater Rim Drive and damaged Halamaumau Overlook. The explosion did not release any lava, which suggests to scientists that it was driven by hydrothermal or gas sources. This explosion event followed the opening of a major sulfur dioxide gas vent, greatly increasing levels emitted from the Halamaumau crater. The dangerous increase of sulfur dioxide gas prompted closures of Crater Rim Drive between the Jagger Museum south, southeast to Chain of Craters Road, Crater Rim Trail from Kilauea Military Camp south, southeast to Chain of Craters Road, and all trails leading to Halamaumau Crater, including those from Byron Ledge, Iliahi Sandalwood Trail, and Kau Desert Trail. In mid May 2018, the park was closed due to explosive eruptions at Halama U Crater. As of May 31, the Kilauea area of the park has remained closed, making the closure the longest in the park's history. Gallery See also Chain of Craters Road Devastation Trail Kilauea Iki List of National Parks of the United States